All right, video time. It's Leonidas here. I am in Ekaterinburg, Russia. The city itself is quite nice. It was founded by a lawyer and a some other dude, and they basically wanted to found the city for Katerina the Great. Okay, so this this is one of their dedications for it. It didn't actually become a a major township or major city until maybe 70 years later after it was founded. And the year of founding was somewhere in the 1730s, around there. The city itself was fa it was then eventually gentrified after about 100 years into a me metallurgical city. So basically a lot of metal working and all that other fun stuff. And then during the Second World War, a lot of tanks, ships, planes started coming out of here because they have a lot of metal in the nearby hills and stuff. Also, an important thing was that when the Bolsheviks were trying to take over the Russian Empire, they basically took over the St. Petersburg, and then they expelled the royal family, the Tsarist family. Because of that, the Tsarist family was expelled to this city, their famous Ekaterinburg city. And then not long after, when the monarchs, the Tsarist army, the non-Bolsheviks, the non-communists tried to save them, they basically, the Bolsheviks, the communists, basically took them out into the woods, the royal family, and shot them all and put acid on all the bodies. So basically, you couldn't memor memorialize these people. Now, another interesting thing was that there used to be a house here, and that house was owned by the royal family. And that was also eventually, in 1977, I believe, burned to the ground or destroyed so that people could not memorialize the family once again. The city itself, the contemporary city itself, is becoming very gentrified. I can't really show you here, but even the mall behind me, I guess I used to be some kind of imperial palace, perhaps? But now it's a big shopping center like everything else in the rest of the world. There's a lot of older buildings in the area. So for example, behind me, it's a slightly older building. This building was built in the 19, from 1928 to 1930. I believe that's what I read. It was dedicated to the Soviet Union. If you actually look, there's a medallion up there. Uh, it's dedicated to the USSR. So the city itself is becoming very, very gentrified. It's definitely not like a St. Petersburg. It's more like a small version of Moscow where you have old buildings next to new buildings. Very simply, like for example, in the distance there, you can see two things. One is the old style of Ekaterinburg, and right above it is this big-ass tower that's dedicated to industrialization, capitalism. So, Leonidas here, once again, coming from Ekaterinburg. Right now, the weather is amazing. When I arrived, it was like zero degrees, but right now, the weather is closer to 20, 25 degrees, very sunny. And from here on, I will be going to Minsk, and then to Moscow, and then to Ivanovo to see my grandma. And then from there, the world is an open oyster. So, Leonidas, I will see you in the next video. Espero que você goste, gostou o vídeo. E no dia estou, vamos para o vídeo. Salute.